what's going on today guys back at you with another video uh today we are going to be bringing something new to the channel uh i'm going to pick it up and i'm not real sure what we're going to do today yet <clears throat> or what we're going to do with this project uh really thinking about just fixing it up and selling it and you know just changing a few things uh we do have some work to do to it i know that we have to change some minor problems that we have with it but uh <clears throat> i'm gonna pick y'all up as soon as i get it and i will let y'all know all right guys i'm back uh we picked it up as you can see it's sitting right there uh if you can guess what it is it is a rancher uh so right now we're gonna head over to the fuller store my part store and we're gonna get a spark plug and just a couple other things try to make this thing run it didn't want to crank at the house uh whenever i picked it up it cranked but it, it cut off we gotta get some gas for it spark plug maybe a coil uh but i'm gonna get those things and then i'll pick y'all guys up back whenever i get out the house get it unloaded what's going on today guys uh so the other day yesterday uh, I showed you where I picked it up and we have got everything and I told you guys that we're gonna need Or I was trying to get it running uh, Needs a carburetor. This carburetor's junk. As you can see I had to go buy a new fuel line and fuel filter The other one was junk. The other one is right here and you can see all that junk down in it So went and bought a new one put it on so I've ordered a carburetor waiting for it to come in Like I said guys, I'm not sure if I'm gonna flip this or keep it whatever so I'm gonna put you guys on the loop and I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna clean it. I've done sprayed it down with some purple power, uh, still spraying it down, but like I said, I'm gonna put you guys on the loop and let y'all watch. All right, guys, we're back. Uh, as you can see, uh, we washed it. We got everything going on. Uh, I'm gonna give you guys a product. I don't know if many of y'all guys use it, uh, but I love this stuff, absolutely love it. Uh, we have a Yamaha 660 Rhino, I do believe. It's a Rhino, I don't know about 660. Uh, try to zoom in on it. Sitting way back there in the shed. You can see how dirty it is. Uh, that's a 2006 model, and I made this thing look absolutely brand new, spotless. Looked like it just rolled off the showroom floor. Is this magical stuff right here? Love this stuff. If you haven't checked it out or used it, please go use it. Uh, as you can see, it's so slippery I dropped it. Uh, it's made by Maxima. Uh, they sell a couple other products. I think, yeah, they make the Fab One air filter spray that comes on your air filters whenever you buy a four-wheeler. Uh, as you can see, it really helps out with the black. As you can see the fender here, really splotchy. So, it's basically like a back to black by Meguiar's, but this stuff I feel like is a lot better. I've used like tons of tire shine on the four wheeler on mine over there. And none of them just compare to this stuff right here. Uh, I spray this on absolutely everything on the four wheeler. Absolutely everything. And I 100% would use it any day of the week without a doubt. Uh, 
you know, I, like I said, I sprayed on everything. Haven't had a problem with nothing electrical, nothing like that. Uh, but it does make the four wheeler look brand new. Makes it look a thousand times better. You can see there, working really good. And I missed a spot right there. Well, it didn't bring that spot back, but. I spray it all up underneath the motor, everything else. All up in here, right there, right there. Gas cap, there, there. And I think my can's leaking. Yeah, it is. Uh, but, like I said, that stuff is best stuff to use for a fuller for cleaning it, hands down. No doubt about it. If you want to argue, we will argue, because I will choose this stuff over anything for a fuller. But, uh, like I said, I don't know what we're going to do with this thing yet. Uh, we do have the 300. Got a few things coming up for it. Got the 420. May have a few things coming up for it. Got some riding videos maybe coming out. Uh, this, I don't really know what we're going to do yet. I know I'm trying to make this channel four-wheeler off-road truck channel. But, uh, let me get back to you guys on this video. Uh, I have some people coming to look at this car and they had just pulled up or about to pull up. They just tasted me. Uh, so I will pick y'all up where we left off right as soon as they leave. All right, guys, I know this has been a crazy video. We've been all over the place. Uh, it's been a couple days since, or not a couple days. It's been earlier since I've been back with y'all guys, but this video has been over the past couple days about getting it. I've been real busy in between. So I've just been taking videos as I go along. Uh, so I believe where we were is what we're going to do. Uh, so new carburetor, got to get one of those. Uh, as you can see, the another problem we've got going on is, uh, the fan. Uh, I forgot what part it's called. The thing that makes the fan cut on whenever it gets hot. I forgot what the part is actually called for it, but, uh, as you can see, the battery's dead, so got the jump box. Whenever you cut the jump box on and cut the key on, I don't know if you guys can hear that, so the fan cuts on and it stays running the entire the entire time. So uh, we're gonna have to get that part fixed. But I did clean it up. I showed you guys the SC1. Uh, the plastics, I figured that they would have come better than that, but I figured it'd be more of this color. But I think the sun has just faded them out. Uh, as you can see, it looks really, really good where the red is. If you have a new foil and the plastics ain't pink like that, it, this foil would have really popped. But as you can see, the plastics are just real bad faded. Uh, but I mean, as you can see this side, I mean, it looks good. All through there. The only spot really got it was right up there. Uh, but yeah, it is pink. I know. Uh, but like I said, what do you guys think I should do with it? Should I flip it? Make the money? Maybe get something else for the channel? We do have the other two four wheelers. Uh, but I think I'm going to end the video right here. Just figured you guys would want to come along just to see. What we got going on but this thing is super duper clean once i get the carburetor going or get the new carburetor and get it put on i think this fuller will run like a champ it used to run like a champ uh the i did pick this up from my dad he had it bought it from him uh just to fix he he said that ain't been running in a while but cleaned it all up i mean as you can see i mean you still got a little stuff here and there but I mean, it's dirty a little bit under here, but it is really, really, really clean. Uh, but the motor, I mean, everything is there. It's really clean. But like I said, I think I'm just going to end the video right here. Uh, today is Sunday. I'm going to try to have it uploaded by tonight. If not, Monday. Uh... I am going to be posting these videos on the Facebook forums that I follow. Uh, 
I've had a couple others that I've posted on there with guy with the questions that I see the most often on the Facebook forums, uh, like the sound bar, the light bar. Uh, I do have videos on the 300. Uh, should have a video on the brake disc conversion that I'm gonna be getting here soon. Uh, after Christmas, once all that's over with, you know. But Rancher 350. Got the Rancher 350. Rancher 420, 400 four or not 400, I don't even know why I said 400, 300 four tracks. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want to see more, let me know. Like I said, these will be going up on the Facebook forums. But if you do please see this and you like these videos, please subscribe, please comment, and please give me a thumbs up. Let me let me got let let me know what you think. Let me know what you guys want to see. Sarge, Sarge, what do you have in your mouth? Uh, okay, all right, well, whatever. But, uh, I'm still confused on what he had in his mouth. But, like I said, if you wanna see more, please let me know. Please comment down below what you wanna see, and I'll see y'all guys in the next video.